I'm in Microsoft Windows 11 and in Hyper-V, and I'm going to show you how to create a checkpoint. So it doesn't matter which operating system you're using or whether it's running or turned off. You can create a checkpoint simply by right-clicking on the virtual machine and clicking on Checkpoint. And when it's done being created, you'll see it show up in this center section. Now, it's not a great idea to have checkpoints on indefinitely because it will create a separate file that can get corrupted and slow things down. It can also eat up a lot of hard drive space. So the best time to create a checkpoint is just before you're about to make any kind of change, such as a Windows update, a new application is going to be installed, that kind of thing. And then when you're done, you can go back and delete that checkpoint. Now, we've got our checkpoint created, as you see here. So if I need to, I can go ahead and run my updates or in my installation. And if things don't go well, then I can go back to the, the previous version by clicking on Apply. And then it'll shut down, restart, and then I'll be back on uh, my operating system the way it was prior to making those changes. So that's how you create a checkpoint in Windows 11 Hyper-V. And it's also the same for other versions as well.